Hey guys, this is Stencil Chris. This is my new game, Kitty City. Uh, this is the desktop build, and I'm just going to show you guys a little bit about how to play. So when you boot up the game, it looks a little bit like this. I'll take you through a tutorial. Uh, you get to see this cute, adorable cat named Perry, and he's a kitty. Welcome to the Kitty City. Um, there's a bunch of um, dialogue here. Uh, he's basically saying that you want to match up these cats by clicking on the board in, in these different grid, in these different cells. So let me show you how to do that. Um, this tutorial is sort of guided, so he'll sort of highlight the, the cells that I should click on. So he wants me to uh, clear these purple ones, so I would go through and click one of these cells. As you can see, it matched up the ones because they're in the same column. Great. So as I go through, he's also going to show you that you cannot see, for example, you cannot click the one that is blocked by another kitty. Only if there's an empty space between the kitties can you can you go ahead and match them up, which is really cool. So the, the really interesting part about this game that I really like is that it's not just row or column, it's both row and column that must that mu they must share in order to um, in order to be matched. So let, let me show you. So when I click here, you will see that these cats are cleared, and that is because they um, they sort of intersected, their row and column intersected at that point, which is really cool. So he wants me to clear up this level, and he talks about the special kitties that I'll show you guys in a minute. But let me just clear up this level. So as you can see, whenever you click, it shows the sort of the crosshairs, um, and it, it really gives you an idea of, of how it's searching, searching for um, anything in the row or column. So I click that, and this kitty's gone. Nope, nope, nope. Yes. Perfect. Then after each level, we'll play a little fanfare you can return. So there are four different modes. There is the play mode, which is just the objectives. Endless mode, if you want to just continually match kitties. Time trial, where you have two minutes to rack up a high score. And puzzle mode, which allows you to um, clear the kitties and you have a limited... Um, no, sorry, you don't have a limit. You, you, can, you must uh, match almost all the kitties at, at 95%. So the game has 150 levels. Uh, 75 objectives and 75 puzzles. Uh, <laughs> this is not indicative of my ability. I just um, didn't get through all 75 yet. So I'll show you guys how that looks. So um, yeah, here you can see that it wants you to clear a level by getting the number of kitties under 50% within the time limit. So this is what the board looks like. Um, you want to go through and match these kitties. Um, I can play at a very quick speed because I have debugged this game, but you'll want to sort of see what I'm doing. This should give you a bit of an idea of how to play. And as, as you match these kitties, there's a combo meter at the bottom. And it sort of runs down every time you click, it sort of bounces up and gives you a little bit of time. And the way that works is you get more, you get a higher score the longer your combo is. And also the longer your combo is, the better chance you have of generating these special kitties. So this, this uh, white tiger will uh, match all the kitties of the same color on the board. Um, <laughs> I didn't see what color it chose, but it, it chose a color and matched all the kitties, which is pretty cool. And once you've completed the goal, it takes you to the victory screen. So that is the objective mode. It's a lot more involved later on. Uh, the puzzle mode, I'll show you. Um, I have not completed that either, but I'll show you moderately difficult puzzle mode. So you want to clear to get the number of kitties under 5% within the time limit. So this, this board was created by us. Uh, it's Stencil Chris, and you'll. <laughs> it's definitely doable to get it under 5%. Um, you just have to use your brain and figure out, um, like, say, for instance, if I match these kitties' hair, then this one kitty will remain, and that we don't want that. So we, we choose this cell to match all three kitties at once. And then this is just the natural progression because I've built this level. And the double cursor is just for the desktop build as I'm debugging and figuring out where the mouse goes. Obviously, uh, on a tablet, you do not have a mouse. 
endless mode is very self-explanatory, so I'll just take you to time trial. I won't have you sit through the entire two minutes, but uh, I'll probably show off a little bit and show you how, how fast I can match these kitties. So you can, it, it says get the highest score in, in the allotted time. And yeah, watch me play. Yeah, so the game ended. Unfortunately, I didn't beat my high score, but hey, you have the option to retry or just return. So yeah, that's about the gist of Kitty City. As I said, there's 150 levels to play through. I find the game a bit therapeutic and nice. You just sit and listen to the uh, calming music, and then eventually you will just have fun matching kitties in Kitty City. So if you like this game, it's completely free. Just go to the App Store. Uh, or click the link in the description and you'll be able to play Kitty City. And you know, leave a comment if you find anything wrong with the game or if something doesn't suit your fancy or if you just love the game and just want to give me a great review. I'd love it. Go through and leave a comment on YouTube or Google Play or wherever you want. Uh, really help out. So thanks a bunch guys and this is Stencil Chris signing out.